building a gearbox to suit exactly what you want. Now, crown wheel, go ahead and set that off to the side here. Next up, we have the actual pin that goes across the differential. So this is your drive cage right here, and you can see it has a hole on the side of it there. This is where this pin slides through and this pin holds your two planetary gears, if you're going with a single pin diff, inside that differential and allows them to spin freely. Now, it's really, really important. There are a few different pins you can get for a Classic Mini. All of the ones that you get from Mini Spares at this point or any other parts supplier are going to be uprated. At this point in time, it's really unusual for you to find one that isn't uprated with a nicer style metal. And the reason that is, is because if you take a look at this one right here, this is actually what came out of the Cooper S. Now, the reason that is, is you can see this one that came out of the Cooper S literally has grooves ironed down and driven down into the 